And now we turn to Madrid. Don Quixote, the man from La Mancha, is perhaps Spain's most famous literary character. His creator, Miguel de Cervantes, is often referred to as the father of the modern novel. And now, almost 400 years after his death, archaeologists may have solved the mystery of where the famed Spanish writer was laid to rest. Miguel de Cervantes was buried in 1616 at a convent of the Barefoot Trinitarians in Madrid's historic literary quarter. But exact whereabouts of his grave within the convent chapel are unknown. Now experts searching for his remains say they have found wooden fragments of a casket bearing the initials MC with bones in and around them in the crypt underneath the chapel. At the moment, we cannot confirm that we have found Cervantes. We cannot be sure that this is Cervantes' coffin. But what is true is that we have discovered a coffin that is very damaged, degraded, with some damaged bones inside in that tomb in the crypt. The bones of at least ten people were found inside the niche containing the broken wooden planks of the coffin. Archaeologists will now start examining the bones to try to determine whether Cervantes are among them. The investigation will refer to the author's portraits and his own stories, in which he relates that shortly before dying he only has six teeth. But the most obvious marks will be the battle wounds that Cervantes sustained in 1571 while fighting Ottoman Turkish forces at the Battle of Lepanto. Four centuries after his death, Spaniards hope to soon learn the great literary master's final resting place. The first phase of the excavation, costing some 50,000 euros, is expected to last two weeks.